Hi Kevin, hopefully you can hear me above the noise of the tractor. Uh, this is my 2023 1025R. And here's the single point connector. This is where I had the gauge. And when I plug this into the blue line, if it's on the inside, it rubs with the coil as it goes up and down. If it's on the other side, of course, it hits the cover, especially when you're trying to move the side panel. So imagine this in here, even on a slight angle, as I would raise the loader. Now the coil eats up the slack and gives extra room for when the bucket comes up. But with this in here, on the inside or outside, it's going to interfere with the hydraulic hoses on the soft side. So one thing I consider doing is changing out all four of these hoses into shorter lengths and then making loops that would come into the connectors. But depending if you're digging down or raising up, that adds all kinds of extra hose length and what you would need. It would also possibly interfere with the inside side panel. That's what it is with the, well, the complications I see using the scale kit with the loader in place. Let me try to reconfigure this a little bit and I'll show you the complications I had when I tried to remove the loader assembly. When the, when the leg goes down, well, I'll show you in the next video.